Hello, my fellow Americans. Tis I, the rumpled one, and hello to the rest of YouTubers who aren't Americans. Okay, we've had the uh, Republican convention. We now have got the Democratic convention. But it's so interesting that uh, looks like the Democrat leadership kind of got their got caught with their hand in the cookie jar, caught fixing things, as as in the fix is in. We all knew it, but now it's kind of like been exposed out in the open. But that being said, are you, people are still going to vote for Hillary. And she claims, oh, I didn't know anything about it. I just hope they have some emails that prove that once again she lied. But yeah, the thing is, even if we have those emails that prove that she lied, What's going to happen? Probably nothing. People still going to vote for her. I heard something and it just really, really hit home. They were talking about that Debbie Wasserman. And it was something to the effect that, you know, she's done so much for the party. She needs, you know, she needs to go out on a high note or something. It's just like, no, the woman <laughs> rigged the system. But... Somehow they want to just forgive her that. It, I mean, the, the hypocrisy. The double standards. I'm, I mean, it's right in your face. And they do it so blatantly. But they have no signs of remorse. None. Zero. Zilch. I, they just really must think, or know, that the American voter is just so stupid. So stupid. Stupid is defined as knowing better but doing otherwise, such as putting your hand on the stove and getting it burned. First time is ignorance. You didn't know it was hot, but then you do it again. That's stupid. So, they know the American voters are so stupid that they will keep voting for the people and, getting, and the voters will keep getting their hands burned. They know this. Otherwise, they wouldn't do what they're doing. They know they can bamboozle you. They know that you've drank so much Obama aid and Hillary aid or smoked Hillary weed or whatever that it doesn't matter what they do. If they can get you to accept men going into the bathroom with little girls, they know they can do anything. Remember I told you it was a test. If you go back and look at some of those videos, video of mine, I said at first it was, I thought it was a distraction, then I said it was a test. Well, see, they tested it, they crammed it down your throats, you swallowed it. So now they know they can get away with just about anything, even if it's out in the open, blatant, blatant cheating. Now, I don't, I'm, I'm not an expert on election laws or anything, but don't you think rigging a convention, rigging delegates, that's some type of voting election fraud? Shouldn't somebody be in jail? But what also bothers me about all this is now the FBI is looking at the Russians to figure out this. Why is it that the FBI gets called in on this, but if you and I, if somebody, you know, breaks into our account, do you think the FBI is going to scrutinize that? Oh, no. But who pays the FBI salary? You and I, right? But they're, they're going to put all their efforts on, on this. So, in other words, they're, they're trying to get you to take, get you to be distracted. In other words, forget about the violations that the Democratic National Convention have been perpetuating, forget about that. Let's focus on how we learned about that. You see how they distract you? They want to distract you. Over here, it's the Russians. No, don't worry about the Democrats. No, no, it's the Russians. They did this. You see how that works? That's what they do. They are distracting you. Look over here. I've told you this <coughs> many, many times. 
But there, it's, it's so blatant. It's so in your face. It's so in your face. You just have to wake up and smell the tyranny.